Imagine making a, a deposit into your bank mm -hmm. and then the money disappears. That's what happened to one bank customer who had his entire paycheck vanish. Consumer reporter John Matteries has some tips on how to keep this happen from happening to you so you don't waste or lose your money. Most of us use ATMs to withdraw cash, but some people, like workers who rely on tips, use ATMs to deposit cash. Have you ever wondered, is that risky? Eric Morton says he's out a bunch of cash. Actually, a lot of cash, after what he believes was an ATM malfunction. I came in, put my card in. He says he then deposited $1,300 cash, yes, more than $1,000 cash, into this ATM. As it's processing, an uh, error hits the screen. Confused, he decided to check his account. I then checked my account to see, oh, well, maybe it was a mistake, maybe it's in there. It was not in there. Eric owns a courier company and says he frequently deposits cash. But he says when he called the bank's security department, the agent questioned whether he was telling the truth. So I feel like I'm defending myself more than you, you're helping me. I'm trying to figure out where my $1,300 went and nobody can tell me anything. Eric says he's not asking the bank to take him at his word. He just wants them to look at the footage from the camera on and the cameras around that ATM. That's all I've been asking is check the camera footage. So don't let this happen to you. Bankrate.com says with cash, use an ATM at a physical bank, not a freestanding one. Don't deposit cash into an out of network ATM and consider using a live teller if if it's a very large amount. What's your feeling about putting uh, money, cash into an ATM? I don't want to do it no more. I'll go straight to, a, straight to a bank, no matter how much time it takes me, no matter where that bank is. Good news, after we got involved, the bank looked at the video, determined Eric was telling the truth, and has now returned his money to him. So as don't waste your money. I'm John Matteries, 23 ABC.